Grant's Getaways is brought to you by Visit Tillamook Coast and KGW. The Oregon Dunes is a giant sandbox that takes the breath away. Many plan vacation time at one of the oldest parklands in the state. Honeyman was built by the Civilian Conservation Corps, or CCC, in 1933. Honeyman is like a bedroom, really, for people who use this as a base camp for exploring a lot of other dune options here in the area. The lakes for fishing and boating and trails through the dunes that you can hike or take an ATV on, sort of a destination. Here's another, five miles north, a state park that's a unique botanical garden. Stroll the boardwalk at Darlingtonia Natural Area and gaze across a collection of native carnivorous plants. Amazing cobra lilies that I've never seen grow so healthily anywhere. They're a foot and a half to two feet tall and these gorgeous lanterns that have this great way of capturing insects and digesting them. It attracts people from all over the world. <laughs> When you step up and buckle up inside dune buggy number six, be ready for a one-of-a-kind experience exploring the dunes. We've got right at 62 miles of dunes to play on there. Everybody got to make sure you're buckled up. Dune buggy rides at Sand Dunes Frontier reach back to the 1950s when entrepreneur Rush Chapman, sporting his famous cowboy hat, created a new way for folks to get around the Oregon dunes. My dad was a Marine and he, you know, basically grabbed a couple old military transports, cut them up, threw some, you know, big old seats in them, and there you go at that point in time. They were fun. They still are. Just do what I do if you get scared, close your eyes. Especially perched atop a 100 foot tall dune. Hang on, folks. and drive buggy can carry a couple dozen visitors who are thrilled by the two-hour tour. <laughs> Powered by a 454 Chevy big block engine, buggy number six rolls on airplane tires with just 10 pounds of air pressure. It's just practice. That's it, just practice. You gotta be able to read the dunes. If you drive up and down the coast, there's such a tree line, you don't really see the dunes unless you actually get out there and near Honeyman State Park in the Oregon Dunes with photographer Jeff Kastner. About the only place you can really do it is Honeyman Park. I'm Grant McComey, KGW. And Grant has all the details and directions. Just go to our website, kgw.com. You can also watch his 30-minute show this Saturday and Sunday afternoon at 4 o'clock right here on KGW.